The X1 Neo home robot that looks like it's wearing a sweater and is supposedly a much safer robot to be used in the home. And it's definitely a feat on how far robotic technology has gone. This is like we're witnessing the first stages of a consumer computer back in the 80s, but with robots. And from one of its earlier robots, this is what it would have looked like back in 2023 when the company was showcasing one of its earlier robots running on wheels. I can see how this thing has came a long way. The challenge isn't just Neo's body, it's also its brain. The body has to perform tasks safely, but the brain needs to know how to do them on its own, without human help. But right now, everything I saw Neo do was guided by a skilled pilot. Not quite as autonomous as they turn out to be. And in a world where hackers are out there, there definitely has to be some kind of protection against those individuals that wants to compromise these machines. So don't get me wrong, these robots, I'm very sure they have their use cases in some tasks. But at some point, do we have to consider and how can we be sure that these things won't go rogue and turn against us. But that's just speculation on my part. Or even something comparable to iRobot. We already cannot trust artificial intelligence by large corporations to not spy on us. So imagine if a technology like this starts to be implemented on robots to spy on us and to sell our private data down to what we do in our homes in ways that we never thought of before. So in other words, it's pretty early to know exactly what will go down but we'll have to wait and see and it's only a matter of time until open source equivalents will come around so we have full control of on what we put in these robots on hardware one owns much like the one from 